Welcome to this episode of DIY3DTech.com. In this episode, what we're going to be doing is actually cutting a filter from this filter. So I want to create a filter for my uh, DJI Mavic Pro drone. So this is an infrared filter. Now what I'm going to do is to use this diamond burr to actually cut a smaller version out of this filter, which I've had laying around for video camera. So one of the things I'm doing is using a bit of a taper diamond burr to create an angle on this so when it gets cut out I can slide it into the holder and we'll take a look at that at the bench. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to add some water in here with some uh, high density detergent for lubricants and I'm going to go ahead and start running this job. So I'm going to go ahead and get this set up and then we're going to jump over and watch this baby cut. Hopefully it'll work out. Fingers crossed. Welcome back. So as you saw, I think this is definitely a fail. It ended up breaking the end off this diamond bit and it really just did, didn't do much more than really score this glass. Now I did it at about 20 millimeters a second, which I've cut glass at this speed before, but this really just didn't want to cut. So I'm really not sure what this is made out of that it's so tough. So. Anyways, just know cutting an infrared filter, at least this particular one with a diamond bit, didn't work. So I'm going to go back to the drawing board on this one. If you guys have done anything like this, let me know in the comments below what kind of bit you used and what kind of success you had. So anyways, don't forget the swag shop's going to be up there. Don't forget to subscribe over there. And we'll see you guys in the next video where we try something like this again. We'll see if it works. Cheers. Please click like below and subscribe to the channel. Projects.